Sometimes you need to fight back, I'm sorry. I discuss with him, I teach him uh, what is right, what is wrong. He doesn't have a social media yet. He's not interested in it. Uh, he's all into sport. Behind the fame and power, Baron Trump is a young man growing up in his father's influential footsteps. As the youngest child of former American President Donald Trump, Barron often makes headlines simply by attending public events. However, there is more to this confident teenager than what meets the eye. While Barron's life has undoubtedly been lavish and privileged, some aspects of his upbringing are quite relatable to the average American. In a recent podcast, Joe Rogan discussed some surprising facts about Barron's life, leading to a wild and explosive conversation. What lifestyle was Barron made to adopt, and what seems to be his fate as he transitions into adulthood? In this video, we'll reveal the shocking facts about Barron Trump's childhood that many people are unaware of. Did you know that Melania's pregnancy with Barron was a surprise for both her and Donald Trump? Just a year after they got married, this unexpected blessing came along, shocking the couple. Melania has openly discussed in interviews how Barron is a miracle baby. The pregnancy wasn't planned, and even Donald Trump has admitted he was surprised. Despite the surprise, Barron quickly became Melania's favorite. They have both expressed their adoration for Barron from the very beginning. Donald Trump has often spoken about how special Barron is to him and how proud he is of the young man Barron is becoming. Although Barron was not part of their original plan, Melania and Donald Trump have always been very clear about their love and dedication to him. Choosing a name for their youngest child was quite the experience for Trump and Melania. Donald had a specific name in mind, one he liked but had not used for his other sons. For their previous child, they chose Donald Trump Jr., and Melania was okay with that. However, Donald had a change of heart at the last moment. He revealed to Melania that he had always cherished the name Baron, but never felt confident enough to use it before. This twist was later discussed on The Oprah Winfrey Show, where Donald admitted to his last-minute doubts about the name Baron. Melania, however, had already fallen in love with the name and jokingly argued that it wouldn't be fair to change it after referring to their son as Baron throughout her pregnancy. The name Baron was also inspired by Trump's well-known alias, John Barron, which he used during his real estate career in the 1980s. Despite the alias fading away, Trump's fondness for the name led to it being chosen for their youngest son. Baron Trump's early life is quite unique. Born on March 20, 2006, he became the youngest child of former President Donald Trump and Melania Trump. Despite the family's constant presence in the public eye, his parents made efforts to provide him with a normal childhood. Growing up in Trump Tower in New York City, Baron was largely kept out of the media spotlight. Melania, a very involved parent, ensured that he had a private life despite their fame. After his father's inauguration as president, Barron moved to Washington, D.C., where Melania continued to protect his privacy, allowing him to grow up as normally as possible. This protective approach seemed to work well, as Barron shares a close bond with his nieces and nephews, despite the large age gap between him and his oldest sibling, Donald Trump Jr., who is 29 years older. His close age to his nieces and nephews allows Barron to relate to them easily, creating a unique but close relationship. Barron Trump's linguistic abilities are impressive, especially for someone so young. Being able to speak three languages is a significant achievement, and Barron has shown a natural talent for picking up languages. It all started with his mother's native language, Slovenian. From a very young age, Barron demonstrated a talent for languages. By the time he was five, he had mastered Slovenian, enabling him to converse easily with his mother and grandparents. Melania Trump proudly discussed this in a 2009 interview with People magazine. Even at three years old, Barron could switch between Slovenian and English effortlessly. 
Additionally, Barron started learning French at a young age. Melania expressed her pride in her son's language skills during an appearance on The Joy Bihar Show in 2011. Barron's multilingual ability showcases his talent for languages and is something that many people admire. Barron Trump's education has been a journey through some of the best schools, reflecting his privileged upbringing. He began his education at Columbia Grammar and Preparatory School in New York City, a top private school, while his father was president. When the Trump family moved to Washington, D.C., Barron attended St. Andrew's Episcopal School. Melania chose this school for its diverse student body and strong focus on learning. The school's mission to understand and inspire each student aligned well with the Trump family's values. This change marked a new approach to education for the family. St. Andrews is known for being more expensive than other private schools like Sidwell Friends, typically chosen by presidential families. In 2021, after his father's presidency ended, the Trumps moved to Florida where Barron enrolled at Oxbridge Academy, another top college prep school. His enrollment even included a special announcement welcoming him and his Secret Service detail, an unusual start for any student. Despite the challenges of starting fresh, Barron seems to be settling in well in Palm Beach with his family. Life after the White House is different, with continued public attention but also more freedom. Through all these changes, Barron has shown his ability to adapt and stay resilient. Barron Trump's early life is quite unique. Born on March 20, 2006, he became the youngest child of former President Donald Trump and Melania Trump. Despite the family's constant presence in the public eye, his parents made efforts to provide him with a normal childhood. Growing up in Trump Tower in New York City, Barron was largely kept out of the media spotlight. Melania, a very involved parent, ensured that he had a private life despite their fame. After his father's inauguration as president, Barron moved to Washington, D.C., where Melania continued to protect his privacy, allowing him to grow up as normally as possible. This protective approach seemed to work well, as Barron shares a close bond with his nieces and nephews. Despite the large age gap between him and his oldest sibling, Donald Trump Jr., who is 29 years older, his close age to his nieces and nephews allows Barron to relate to them easily, creating a unique but close relationship. Barron Trump's linguistic abilities are impressive, especially for someone so young. Being able to speak three languages is a significant achievement, and Barron has shown a natural talent for picking up languages. It all started with his mother's native language, Slovenian. From a very young age, Barron demonstrated a talent for languages. By the time he was five, he had mastered Slovenian, enabling him to converse easily with his mother and grandparents. Melania Trump proudly discussed this in a 2009 interview with People magazine. Even at three years old, Barron could switch between Slovenian and English effortlessly. Additionally, Barron started learning French at a young age. Melania expressed her pride in her son's language skills during an appearance on The Joy Bihar Show in 2011. Barron's multilingual ability showcases his talent for languages and is something that many people admire. Barron Trump's education has been a journey through some of the best schools, reflecting his privileged upbringing. He began his education at Columbia Grammar and Preparatory School in New York City, a top private school, while his father was president. When the Trump family moved to Washington, D.C., Byron attended St. Andrew's Episcopal School. Melania chose this school for its diverse student body and strong focus on learning. The school's mission to understand and inspire each student aligned well with the Trump family's values. This change marked a new approach to education for the family. St. Andrews is known for being more expensive than other private schools like Sidwell Friends, typically chosen by presidential families. 
In 2021, after his father's presidency ended, the Trumps moved to Florida, where Barron enrolled at Oxbridge Academy, another top college prep school. His enrollment even included a special announcement welcoming him and his Secret Service detail, an unusual start for any student. Despite the challenges of starting fresh, Barron seems to be settling in well in Palm Beach with his family. Life after the White House is different, with continued public attention but also more freedom. Through all these changes, Barron has shown his ability to adapt and stay resilient.